Sacramento at Malt and Mash right there by Hello. the new arena. Oh, first off, what do you dip a pretzel in? Beer cheese. Oh. What's this one, Bryce? Caramel mustard. Caramel yes. mustard. Oh. I'm at Malt and Mash in the kitchen. This is executive chef Bryce Palmer, who's also executive chef of El Rey, which is next door here. We're going to learn how to make pretzels. Take note. You may uh, hold the mic and tell us what the ingredients are, sir. You may sure hold thing. the mic. So uh, what we have here is a little all-purpose flour, um, a little bit of yeast, a little bit of sugar. We let that rise uh, for about 30 minutes. Um, and then we add our all-purpose flour and our salt. Uh, it's looking great, looking great. Keep going. You want to go out to about three feet. Keep going. Three feet? Yep. Three feet? Right here. Goodness. Come right here. You're almost there. Um, and then we let that rise, and then we mix that up and let it rise one more time, knead it out, um, and then we roll out our pretzels, as you see Tina's doing right now. Okay. Um, and then you want to do the little loop, Tina. Is this good? Yes, that's perfect. Little loop? Yeah. Okay. There you go. Okay. Bring this part. Let's try this. One little. more? Yep, one more. One more? Yeah. And then? And then you bring those, bring these up to the top. Like this? Yep, and then you're gonna oh, flip. Small. You can stretch it out afterwards. Okay, there, like mm -hmm. that. And then you're gonna <laughs> flip like that, and then you got your little pretzel. Ta -da! Bring it right over here to the butter. Okay. And then we're gonna bring this guy over. He said girthy. When do we salt it, Tina? We're gonna bring this guy over and drop him in the water. I'll what we have in the water here is baking boil. soda, uh, brown sugar, and that's what's gonna help with the browning process. Let's and get your two. Let's get these other guys here. Oh. And then we also are going to drop these guys in here. These are the professional looking ones. <laughs> Give about Not two so of them in there. How many do you serve uh, weekly at Malt um, Mash? We serve um, upwards of about 200 pretzels a week wow. on a busy week. What? Uh, 10 ounce, two, or ten, or 200 10 ounce pretzels. Okay, uh, because not so many restaurants make their own here. No, so, not in the house. It's a, but you're getting rave reviews. So, yeah. how long do we put it in the water here? So we do about 20 seconds in the um, brown sugar baking soda water. What does this do for it? This is what achieves that brown skin on the outside. Of hey. The okay. Um, similar process is used when you do uh, don't uh, bagels. Okay. So that's what gives that that nice crust. Okay. So and then, then from here we're gonna add a little butter and a little salt and we'll pop it in the oven. Okay. And then after that, you could bake it for 12 minutes, you said, right? Yeah. And then this is what they this look is like. This finished product. We're going to go ahead and throw these in and heat these up for us so we can taste them on air. We All put right, a little butter. Wrap now. Okay. And there we go. And the Beautiful. butter just helps with taste and a little bit more browning. Okay, you do that. Dave's going to be the taste tester. Why okay. Why can I not, not try a pretzel today? Is because I have to get some blood work a little while oh. from now. Oh. So I had a fast. Oh, that's the worst. That so I will take one with me in my in my little pocket purse. <laughs> All right. Well, thank Save you so much later. for teaching Ooh. us. We'll have Dave try one during question of the day. Okay. Bryce Palmer, everybody. Malt and Mash on K Street around the arena. Back to you. Nice. Bryce Palmer, who just got married recently in the oh. last I think, month. It was. Congratulations.